Hey guys, I'm Lauren from My Something Beautiful Life, and today I have an Erin Condren unboxing for you. This is my order from their recent warehouse sale, and they also had planners for 60% off, so I grabbed a couple of those. You can probably tell, but this box is uh, kind of big, and so I'm going to actually move it out of the way, and I'll just show you all the things that I got inside. So the first things that I picked up were these two notebooks. These are limited edition notebooks that they released just for the warehouse sale. This one has a hardcover. It's kind of a turquoise aqua color. And it has the little asterisk on the back and a woven wonder pattern on the inside. And what's cool about this notebook is that the inside has lined pages in the front half and then there's dot grid pages in the second half. And then there's a sheet of stickers in the back. And yeah, I mean, it's a notebook. It's a basic notebook. So I'm excited about that. I really just liked the hardcover. Plus I was kind of excited that they put dot grid pages in it because it kind of seems like they've been going away from dot grid in a lot of things. I really hope they're not trying to discontinue the dot grid pages, but I was excited to see them in this notebook. I did want to grab it for that and also just because of the hardcover. And then this is the second one that I got. This is just a simple black pinstripe pattern and then it has the black coil on it, which I absolutely love. Sometimes it's harder to find the black coils. It seems like they offered on some products and not on others. So I just get excited when I see it on things like this. So this is a similar notebook though. The Oh, it's even upside down, okay. But the inside is the same as the hardcover one. It has dot grid pages in the back and some line pages in the front. And then I think there's another sheet of stickers back here. Yep, there is, okay. And then this one actually has the new pattern on the covers. They've been switching over their covers to have this design on the inside instead of just the lines that they had before or blank on some of them, I think. And so this is actually the first one that I've gotten with the new design. So I'm kind of excited to actually see it. I really like this cover. It's just so simple. And in general, I just really love the covers. And so it was just exciting to have a new one that I haven't seen before. One thing that I do think is interesting between these two notebooks is that the coil is actually a different size. I don't know why the black one is bigger and the hardcover one is smaller. To me, it actually would seem like it would make more sense to do it the other way around. My theory, and I have nothing real to base this on, it's just totally a guess. I think they had a bunch of these extra coils laying around and they didn't have anything else to do with them. And so they decided to just put them on notebooks. That's the best thing I can think of. And it may have been the same with this one, but I think this one is the regular notebook size. I think this is the size coil that normally comes on notebooks. But anyway, yeah, I just thought it was interesting that they both had different size coils and they have the same amount of pages in them. It's just the coil that's a little bit different. I'm excited about these, mostly just because in general, I just love notebooks. And then the next thing that I wanted to show you are these little push pins. I went ahead and took the plastic off to make it a little less crinkly. I've actually been eyeing these for a while. And so when I saw them as part of the clearance sale, I just went ahead and got them because I just think they're really pretty. If you can see the little colors inside, I know it's glaring really bad. I'm trying to get away from the glare, but they have a little bit of color inside, but then they're in a clear square cube. And I just thought they were really pretty. So I went ahead and got those too. And then I also got some writing tools. Now, okay, so these two were part of the warehouse sale. This is a fairly new product, and so this one was just normal price. These are the fine tip wet erase markers, and if you tried the white ones that they came out with a while ago, these are pretty similar to that. These are actually like a paint marker, so they're a little bit different than the regular felt tip wet erase markers. I really like the white ones that they had, and I thought these colors were really pretty, and so I wanted to try these out too. And then I also got the regular felt tip ones that these have been on the site for a while. These were part of the warehouse sale. Again, it's something I had been looking at for a while and just never gotten. I'm really actually interested in this gray marker and so I'm excited to try that one out. Especially with the new design on the inside front of the covers, I'm looking forward to actually utilizing that a little bit more and so I wanted some wet erase markers to go along with that. And then the last thing I got is the set of the colorful dual tip markers, and this is the classic set. So I think this one is actually the original, or they may have had a few at the beginning. I think they had this one in pastel and 
I don't remember which one else. But this is just one I've never actually gotten, and I have most of them, but I had never actually tried these particular colors, and some of these are ones I don't have repeats of in my other pens. And so I did grab these while they were on sale. And then the last accessory that I got is this dashboard for the A5 ring agendas. This will fit any standard A5 ring planner, and so if you saw my planner update, then you know that I'm trying to move into a ring planner. And so I got this to use as a bookmark and just to add some extra notes on, so I thought that was really interesting. Plus, I think this is actually going to match really well with the colors on here, so I'm really excited to use these together also. Oh, and this was also part of the warehouse sale. I think it was like $2.75, something like that. So this was definitely on sale too. And it was something I was already planning to get. It had actually already been in my cart, so I was excited to see that it went on sale too. All right, and then the last two things I have to show you are the planners that I got. The first one is the horizontal layout. It's the vertical neutral, and these are the inserts for the ring agendas. So like I just mentioned, I'm trying to move into a rings planner and I really wanted a weekly layout in it. And so I went ahead and grabbed these so that I could put them into my ring planner. I absolutely love the horizontal neutral design. I love these colors so much and I just think it's really pretty. And it's actually sold out on a lot of their planners. I think they're just trying to clean out all of their old inventory of the 2023 planners. So I was really excited that they still had the Harmony Neutral in these inserts. So it was exactly what I wanted. And I'm excited to put this into my planner. And then the last thing that I have to show you is one last planner. So if you can see how big this is, this is a normal seven by nine notebook on top of this planner. So this is definitely not a normal life planner. This is actually the teacher lesson planner and I am not a teacher, but I do work in schools, and so I wanted to try this out for what I'm doing. Up to this point, my organization for work has been a, just a plain notebook, and I've been noticing lately how I'm losing things, and I don't know where the information is when I'm looking for it anymore. And so I wanted to try something that had a little bit more structure to it, and so I picked up this teacher lesson planner and there's a few different parts of it that I think will be just perfect for what I do. I've been wanting to try this out for a while, and so I definitely took advantage of the sale in order to try this out. I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely subscribe if you want to see more planner videos like this. I do a planner update every month, almost, pretty much. If you want to see those, just sharing the planners that I'm using and how I'm using them, if they're working, if they're not working. It's a roller coaster. So definitely go check out that if it sounds interesting to you. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.